guys, welcome back. Okay, so today is something a little bit different and new. Um, a few months ago, a company got a hold of me and was like, hey, would you mind if we send you some products for free for a honest review? And I was like, okay, yeah, no problem, cool. It was hair care products, and I'm a licensed cosmetologist, in case you don't know that, and I live in the world of hair. Hair is what I'm most comfortable in, and I was told that they were gonna be sending me some hair products. I got super duper excited because I was in the market to find new hair products anyways. I needed something different shampoo and conditioner wise because I go through stages where my hair and my skin will start getting really really picky and become allergic to things and react negatively towards a bunch of different shampoo and conditioners. I am allergic to everything that you can buy in a drugstore. All of it. All the shampoo and conditioner. I'm allergic to it. It's fantastic. Makes my head break out, makes my back break out, makes my face break out. It's fantastic let me tell you. So, um, this company, Pure Dior, sent me their stuff, and it's all organic. All of it. It's all organic. It is, this one is their gold label, which I believe their packaging has changed recently. So, it probably will not look like this, but I think it has like little gold leaves. Anyways, um, this one is the Premium Organic Anti-Hair Loss Shampoo, Effective Solution for Thinning Hair. I was up for this just because I lose a bunch of hair, but it doesn't matter because I have a lot of hair. So I guess this is supposed to help your hair become thicker. You're supposed to stop losing as much hair, which is a normal process, and retain more hair. And it has no parabens and no sulfates, which is new for me because I'm used to sulfates and used to parabens and used to it being all sudsy and soapy and just all of that stuff. I was used to that. That's just what most shampoo does. So I was kind of nervous about this. And I'm not on the all organic bandwagon. That's just not my game. Um, I understand that people are for their reasons and that's fine, you know, you do what you think you need to do and how you are comfortable with living your life and what you think is right, then by all means, do it. I'm not going to fault you for it. That's cool. I'm just not on the all organic bandwagon. But, hold on, there is a but. This stuff right here, oh my gosh. Now, I wanted to wait to where I was pretty much done with this to be able to give you a very real review. Now, I'm not going to lie. This stuff right here is amazing. Okay? They're not paying me to say this. They didn't promise me more product after this or anything. This is my 100% real thoughts on this stuff. Now, because I have used just about almost every shampoo and conditioner out there with not very amazing thoughts. I thought Biolage was the be-all and end-all of hair care and once I couldn't use that anymore I was really scared. But something that I noticed with using Biolage and stuff, no matter what hair color I had, I always had bad ends. They're always white at the ends. Now look at your hair right now. Go ahead pull it. If you have a bunch of little white dots at the ends, guess what? You need a trim and you probably put a bunch of heat to your hair. But, I don't know if you guys can see this. I don't have none. I maybe have a couple. There's a couple in there. But, guys, this stuff is legit. And it, they also gave me the conditioner and they gave me the vanilla lavender healing conditioner. And this is all gone. This is all gone. And this, I still have a little bit left of this just because I use conditioner very liberally. I just like slather that in. But you use this and you leave this on your head for like two minutes and then you rinse and then you leave this on your head for two minutes and then rinse and then you follow up with the argan oil. Now this is imported from Morocco, argan oil, and this stuff is the bomb.com y'all. I don't put anything else in my hair besides following the shampoo, the conditioner, then I put this in my hair, I blow dry it, and that's it. Unless I'm going to curl it, then I'll put some hairspray in it, and my coffee just went off. If you hear that beeping, that's what that is, because I'm in my living room, you can hear my coffee pot. Anyways, when Callie was doing my hair, she's like, Tiffany, what is up with your hair? Why is it so soft? And I was like, girl, let me tell ya. 
let me tell you please, it's Pure Dior. Like legitimately, it's Pure Dior. This stuff is as good as they said it was gonna be. They've featured it in numerous magazines and they've put it in swag bags and stuff that I've seen on their Instagram account. And this stuff can be pricey, but it goes a long way. I, let me tell you, as much as I bleached my hair all summer long and earlier on in the year, my ends were fantastic. My hair felt fantastic. Callie was blown away at how good my hair felt. I have gotten many of, what shampoo and conditioner do you use? And I'm like, oh, let me tell you. Just let me tell you all about it. You can only get it on this website, but let me tell you all about it. And FYI, I will leave a link down below. They have a coupon code, START20. You get 20% off of your order for your first order. And I will leave that down there too. It's fantastic. Um, how much my hair has grown. And also, I don't know if you have any experience with red hair color, but let me tell you how fast it fades. Are you ready? Okay, so I got my hair done earlier with Callie. You saw the video of it. I have since dyed my hair again. I don't know if you've noticed it's darker red than it was and it doesn't have all of those colors that were in it, but I've had to color my hair again because red fades so stinking fast. It's, it's irritating. It's beautiful, but it's irritating but my hair is healthy. And I don't get it trimmed as often as you're supposed to. You're supposed to get your hair trimmed every six weeks. Did you know that? To have healthy hair, you're supposed to get your hair trimmed every six weeks. I get mine trimmed every, I don't know, three months. To be honest with you, I cannot get over how good this stuff is. Um, I think I've won over. I really hope that they have like an ambassador program or something that I could be a part of because I am so happy like I will go tell anybody who will listen to me like hey hey do you need new shampoo and conditioner do you well let me tell you all about it Ugh, this stuff mm. now something I did have to get used to is that it doesn't suds up it doesn't it doesn't suds up it will a little bit if you use enough which I don't suggest you do that because it's unnecessary to use that much but it does get your hair extremely clean. Like after you get out of the shower, your hair feels like it's squeaky clean. And then you're, while you're blow drying your hair, because I don't suggest you put anything in it besides the argan oil because you really don't need to. This stuff is awesome. Um, while you're blow drying it, it still feels, you know, squeaky clean and you can't really run your fingers through it. But once it's dry, it feels like silk, guys. Your hair is so soft and it just feels amazing and you can run your fingers through it. Do you guys see that? You can run your fingers through it without your hair, your hands getting caught. Like my finger is not getting caught. Well, it did just then just because I grabbed a crazy part of it. But you can run your fingers through your hair and it won't get caught and you won't have any breakage at the ends. Like guys, seriously. Oh my goodness. Got to try it out if you're in the market for new shampoo and conditioner i really do honestly suggest trying the pure dior just try it out and see what you think if you hate it then tell me about it if you love it tell me about it and then tell them about it and then be like hey i watched tiffany's video and she told me i needed to try this yeah you should just like tell them about it be like hey heard good things about it so let me try it out so yes this is my review my review over the Pure Dior hair, well, is it a hair system? Is that what you would call it? Would you call it a hair system? But it's the shampoo, conditioner, and argon oil. And they sent me, they sent me um, an acne treatment, the tea tree oil acne treatment. To be honest with you, I was not happy with that. So I'm sorry. I don't suggest that one. That, if you want to try it, by all means you try it, but me personally, I did not like that. To see how much everything costs, because I've never heard of this before, I didn't know. It smells medicated. It smells like tea tree oil. And it says smooth over face and neck for cleansing, balancing skin. I'm not really a fan of this either, but that's just because of my skin type. Um, My skin just didn't really like it. it Felt like an oil slick a few hours later. So, me personally, I don't like it. So, whatever. Not a big fan. But I am a fan of the argan oil and the shampoo and conditioner. So, that is it for my review. 
If you have any questions, comments, or if you have tried this, or if you plan on trying it, let me know. I would like to know your thoughts on it too. So leave me a comment down in the comment section. And don't forget, you can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook, all at Tiffany and Co. XO. Please subscribe if you're not subscribed already. I would love to have you here. And we'll see you in the next video.